Ya sudah tu dewek. Kumat tu dia. And that's then. So the moment you come with him here and you expect him to adjust, you will not get it. Whatever and whatever and if it happens, it might not be very real. It might just because you are pushing it so much, then you will get it. And I have always told women, live your life. Make your life work. Make yourself happy. Just be happy. Even when you are not appreciated, be happy. Yeah, we are telling you how to do it. You are not saying that you are not going to do it. But you are not going to do it. Oh, my God, I'm not going to do it. It is a moon. It is a moon. So can you be telling yourself, oh, I'm not going to do it. You might let you be smart. Just tell yourself. Enjoy yourself and feel good about yourself. Because now when you feel good about yourself, you start feeling good about other people. And it will make you feel nice. But it's like, but you see now the life we are living is like a life of taking poison and expecting other people to die. It is you who will die. At the way you stress, at the new body. Oh, what? I say, you are not going to be able to do it. You are not going to be able to do it. You are not going to be able to do it. I don't know how to keep your legs here. And move on with life. Because you have a life to live. And I'm telling men that there is also a reward of the things you are doing. But much of the work is there is a reward. And I always tell men it comes later when you are helpless. Women revenge in old age. Women wait to go and walk in there. How much of the work is there to do? It's only good to have fun. We will be only helpless, very helpless, and no one is willing to take care of you is when you fall in her hands. Maybe a little woman has already a hawk. Oh, how do you know you have to get out of there? Yes, you can go out of there. So, she's a mama, and you can go out of there. So, you can go out of there. So, she moved on. When she needed you, you were not there. So, I'm telling men, if you want to wait gracefully, love your wife and walk your journey with her. Love your life that even in old age she will be able to work with you. The other day we we were with um what is his name Eric's brother Muluri we were with Muluri burying his father who was who was over over ninety years and I saw his mother crying that old lady parting with the old man and she was really crying and you could pity people who loved one another people who really felt that they were parting. And the others, or the Amadik, or or my daughter, or pretend. Give me my girl, my girl, to a girl, because no one will ever be able to. The things you have done to her, the many years you have wounded her, the many years you have hurt her, she cannot even pretend. Eh, or any other thing. The case where the reporter talk with me, I know that the people are straight. No other thing. Nanu wakora ni ya nuda wadu manene wakora aroneri kere rone yotu ko rosi ne woka ya leke no hera ya rone adi gu mali ya le no ma. Nambe pele le ao no eka le le la la. Uwe ni bora kwa kaya na imia na nime na sura umagaja. Na wapo makani mara ya kile la huba imi. So I'm telling the man, okay, you go moke te atumia mta kile la hara karori imi. That's where they go to revenge. Niki wana adu ingeke shagi maja kuli ma mire na koro imi mera kwa tele go kora iha. Oti ni kuli na mire na koli na magero ni kora iha. Mudah ini magero ni kuhuta kahana boksu agen bito. Orang mana mana di magero kuja kan ni kuaga gaya kuliah. So I tell them the other bigger challenge is make sure as you age you have something in your pocket. You have a ATM. The years you have been here, let them count. Let you see what you are doing. If you are the kind of people who are never able to keep your money in your pocket, please give it to us. You buy land, keep a title deed. Lama mama koko kia goma umiye kenya wengine mweenda ulewa kwa nani wana wengine noge 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 and you be able to survive because then when you are not able to plan yourself then things happen the way they happen I I don't want us to take much time but I just want to say this last thing that I will want to walk this journey with you I'm also looking at geriatric support of our old people 
you know our old people have been very neglected, especially those of you who are here. You know sometimes you send support from here to support your parents who has eight other children in Kenya and are not able to take care of them. So there was a time we did a program on TV and we talked about building homes for the aged. It, it didn't work good for us. It was very bad. It became very bad. And the parents were like incited that we are trying to push them out of their homes. You can see now the old women. So we said that one would not work for us. It became very bad. Just as bad as it was during campaign times. Those of you who saw my video on Makeki, an old video of uh, 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 an event we had some times back. And it appeared like it was then, and I almost died. But by the grace of God, I overcame. These are the things that you go through in life so that at the end we are able to say the Lord is going to carry us through. So we have a foundation. After this, I'll possibly will be able to give you my cards. The rest of the things we'll talk later. I'll be able to give you my cards. So when you need to talk to me, talk to us, support us. This is the journey we want to start. We'll be supporting these parents from their homes and even be able to be calling them from their wards and then we we'll go support them from there. Maybe they just have a day, a bench, come sit, catch up, catch up, catch up, and then just go back home because you may not be able to keep them at any other place. I'm looking, the, 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 the woman rep seat is a very social seat. So I'm trying to get as social as possible to restore the dignity of our people. And I want to walk this journey with you. And I want to imagine you're going to walk this journey with me. At least this time, we are only bringing you honest people. When you support me, I'll be able to support people and I'll be able to show you how much I support them. In as much as, or show you also in Optiven. It's also selling new land and giving you titles. Because in Kenya, you have also bought air. Yeah. In Kenya, you have bought. And sometimes it is your very own father. You don't even know what to tell him. You don't even know whether to take him to the police. You don't even know whether to insult him. You only say, Guy, you don't even know. Now we are here telling ourselves that we need to do something. Uh, can we bow down for a word of prayer? Our Father and our God, we want to thank you. We are indeed very grateful that you are such a loving God. When we never deserved your love, you gave it to us. And Lord, we want to thank you because God, you have called us with a purpose. We have some few minutes to share your word and we pray that God, you may use me as I speak to your people. Let the words of my mouth and the meditation of our hearts be acceptable in your sight, our Lord and our Redeemer, for it is in Jesus' name that we pray. Uh, I just want us very briefly to look at the word of God. Uh, those of you that come from my generation, the generation that had one radio, there was a program that used to air from Biblia Usama Studios in Kijabi on Sunday at 3. And one of the songs that I frequently played, it required Nasema, Yaakob alienda kwa mjomba Haka mpenda la heri Siku ya harusi lipofika Haka pewa alia Sia heri Hapinduzi ya baba na mama Halinjua kweli hilea You know that song when she died I can't believe I can't believe I can't believe Umitu mikie naka saba Nita kupara eri Sila eri Mapunduzi ya baba na mama Halinjua kweli hilea Yangu na yawe ya kweli when you are doing even your total, I'm not going to have to go on the radio. 
ਅਸੀਂ ਉਹ ਵੀ ਕੋਈ ਨਹੀਂ ਕੀਤੀ ਆਲੇ ਰੇਟ ਜੀ ਸੋ ਮੈਂ ਵੀ ਆ ਦੀ ਰੇਡੀਓ ਆਰ ਆ ਮੈਜੋਰਿਟੀ ਐਂਡ ਕੈਨ ਕਨੈਕਟ ਵਿਦ ਦੈਟ ਸੌਂਗ ਸੋ ਦੈਟ ਇਜ਼ ਦ ਮੈਸੇਜ ਆ ਵਾਟ ਅਸ ਟੂ ਲੁਕ ਐਟ ਇਜ਼ ਇਨ ਦ ਬੁੱਕ ਆਫ ਜੈਨੇਸਿਸ 29 ਇਟ ਵਾਸ ਅਬਾਊਟ ਥਿਸ ਗਾਇ ਹੂ ਵੈਂਟ ਐਂਡ ਵਰਕਡ ਫੋਰ ਹਿਸ ਅੰਕਲ ਵਾਂਟ ਟੂ ਲਿਵ ਵਿਦ ਹਿਸ ਅੰਕਲ ਐਂਡ ਵਾਂਟਡ ਅ ਵਾਈਫ ਐਂਡ ਸਪੋਟਡ ਵਨ ਗਰਲ ਹੂ ਵਾਸ ਵੈਰੀ ਬਿਊਟੀਫੁਲ ਐਂਡ ਹੀ ਡਿਸਾਈਡਡ ਹੀ ਵਾਂਟਡ ਟੂ ਮੈਰੀ ਥਿਸ ਗਰਲ ਐਂਡ ਥਿਸ ਬਿਊਟੀਫੁਲ ਗਰਲ ਵਾਸ ਕਾਲਡ ਰਿਚ ਐਂਡ ਹੀ ਰੀਲ ਲਵਡ ਰਿਚ but on the wedding day the uncle became chicky the girl was brought in a veil just as we do in our weddings i think this is where the culture is gotten from so the girl was brought in a veil but was not the girl he loved he was brought the girl he didn't love the other girl, the other girl was called leah now leah the bible says i had emotion you know the bible says you are ugly and it is the same bible that says that we are fearfully and wonderfully made then when the same bible says you are ugly then you are indeed very ugly and the bible even defines that lady that are my go machishi her eyes ne mare na ga my doll ko hutu ya modu ogi amwedie but on the wedding day the uncle decided to give that other girl and because when men think about women in matter sex They, they don't really mind so much about so many other things when it comes to matter sex men are different from women and this is why we have issues when it comes to matter sex for married people because women will always want to ask why should i have sex with you and the way you have hurt me why should i have sex with you and i know you have a girlfriend Why should I have sex with you and the way you've been treating me? To women that is an issue. But to men it is never an issue. It is women who ask why. Men ask where. Men have no issues of what had happened. I remember kora go me ha kora igerera. No do me so mange to arage. Well that's the difference. So when this guy was brought the why he didn't even care to run whether it was the other one or whoever. because to men it is where for women it is why and this is why i always tell men when you have hurt a woman it is important to make sure that you you work it out because it is in that moment that those things start ringing in our mind and this is why you see women will start bringing issues at that point when you try to pursue her it is the time she reminds you umenye do wali hanyuba women are the school fees and you go down and you cannot be able because to women it is why but to men it is where so this guy got this lady and they slept together and in the morning it is when he looked at her like they that no he did not even know what to say or even what to do but now that he had got him he went back to the uncle and the uncle told him in our culture which is like the kikuyu culture and many of us is culture we never give the younger girl before the older one is given out so the uncle was good enough he said but if you want if you still want Rachel you can still work for me for seven more years but in the meantime utachukua tu wote wawili and i'm sure men would have loved such a father in law where you buy one and get one <laughs> So, so he was given both but again he had to work for seven more years but with both so he was told you can stay with the other one for a week then I will bring you the younger one the next few days and then after that you will work for me for seven more years so he paid a dowry of working for his uncle for 14 years he worked for the uncle for 14 years and now he has the wives and this is where I want our message to come this day The message is persisting persisting towards your goal. You may try this it doesn't work. And you people are a good example. I am sure when you decided to come to the US a number of things had gone wrong. And you told yourself, "Do we get a visa? Ni America. You know the biashara ni ago yi. Ore mvuri ni subua. O ni mami yaranya da we don't have money our everybody in our families with us. Do they see you are the favorites of everybody in the family you are and you are my Jew 
and you know you're good and everybody calls you with so many stories but when you are there even those who had never had respect for you so it, it also happened even in those years and now here we are the lord has is calling us to persist even when it doesn't seem to be working persisting to make sure that it works so Leah did not have children i mean uh, rachel never had children and the bible says that the lord had closed a womb that she never got children but Le but Leah, who was hated this is what i do not understand about men this lady she, she hated is the one who was giving birth to children but the one he loved was barren i don't know how he hated her and he kept getting children with her but as i have told you to men that is not an issue so this is in the book of genesis 29 is there anyone with a big book with the bigger scriptures to scripts than this one let me use my glasses this should tell you 50 has come uh this is 29 verse um verse 30 it says uh, verse 31 when the lord saw that leah was not loved he enabled her to conceive to conceive but rachel remained childless leah became pregnant and gave birth to a son she named him reuben for she said it is because the lord has seen my misery surely my husband will love me now that was the first child she conceived again and when she gave birth to a son she said because the lord had that I am not loved. He gave me this one too. She named him Simeon. Again she conceived. And when she gave birth to a son, she said, Now at last my husband will become attached to me because I have borne him three sons. So he named him Levi. So this lady has given birth to three sons. There is Reuben, there is Simon, and there is lady and this lady a feeling now has achieved and even in our culture when we give birth to boys it appears like it is what is acceptable in the society a mother of boys feels an achiever because because they know that the society approves that you are more of a mother when you have boys but to god a child is a child but again when god gave a child he gave a seed god gives seed because i always ask myself if a man if a woman is very serious and does not give to, to uh, does not give birth to triplets or twins how many times does a woman give birth in one year? Just once. Even if you get triplets, it's just once in a year. And how many children does a man get in one year and don't even answer me? Because they will be not countless. So God gives, God gave boys because he wanted to give a seed. So this woman has given birth to the first child. And the husband comes and he's told that your wife has gotten a baby. And he asks, Oh, Reuben. Ah, I know how I ask. And then he moves again and comes another day. Oh, she's gotten another one. What is her name? And this lady tells herself, For sure, this time I have given birth to another boy. My husband will love me. And he calls him Simeon. And then he goes ahead, he gets another one, a third one. And then she says, I know. This time round, he will love me. But again, she realizes the man still does not care. He only asks, the I don't know. I don't know. But now, finally, as the Bible tells us, that this lady got a fourth boy. When she got a fourth boy, she said, This time 
I will praise the Lord. And she called the boy Judah. She said, now this time I'm not going to impress anybody. I do not care whether now he's going to be impressed. My purpose is one now. I will praise the Lord. That he has given me four sons. Now I'm a mother of four. I was the hated one, but I am a mother of four boys. So I have a whole generation ahead of me. So what do I need to do now? I will need to praise the Lord. I do not know what is this that you have tried. And I am sure those, a majority, not a majority, I think all of you have a story to tell of how much you have tried. You got married. You try to be the best girl. When you get married, you have heard so many stories of mothers-in-law. When you get to that home, you want to be the best. And you imagine that all these other people are haters. You will be the best daughter-in-law. You try hard to become the very best daughter-in-law. But one morning, your mother-in-law tells you a word. You don't even want to imagine it is you who has been told. You have tried your best to be the best mother. It doesn't work out for you. You are a mother. You are a widow. Your husband was sick. You tried everything. You took him to hospital. You brought him home. You took care of him. He died. What did your in-law say? He called a tana roro. Usi da na morali mokare mori ya budi kanida. Ah tora motika. When you imagine what you went through, you just want to die the following day. There is so much that you have tried. You have tried to impress your husband, isn't it? There is a lady who told me, You are going to do the king there. That's your mother who got a little bit of a man. Give me the kid, mother. Money, I know I love her. So tell me what I am going to do. Because that's your mother. Give me a pure hoop. I need the hoop. I have a pure akida. I call a dick. Be hana to me as you see the rock you want to make up. Father, if I see a dude. Now, you make a grammatic. I demand the kick of a whole. I dress properly. I do things right. I try to do my very best. But it is still not working for me. It is still very difficult for me. It is still too painful for me. What was I supposed to do? This lady looked at the whole thing and he said, This time I will praise the Lord. So I have come with the message to tell you people that this time now. You need to look to look up at the cross in your family. You only need to look at the Lord to see what is going to happen and what the Lord has for you in store. You drive the family. It did work. You wanted to be the best wife. It did work. Okay, and yet you did see. You are there, hating yourself, expecting people to sympathize with you. We will not. We will hurt you the more. Choose to praise the Lord. Choose to move on. Choose to live your life. Purpose to make your life better. Because it is by the grace of God that you are who you are. But when you start looking back and try to impress people, try to see what you can do, people can never be impressed. It is not long ago in Kenya, we were singing, Toga kera tene, Toga kera tene, Toga kera tene, Today, the story is different. The things they are saying about the same person, because these are human beings. So what do you need to do? Focus on where you are going. If it is in matters of your family, focus where you are going. Because it is only you who knows where you are going. You have those husbands in Kenya, and those men, I was telling them the other day, there was this one man who who was a drunkard and he dr he drank he drank and drank bisa paka the wife now got used to his drinking until the wife started bringing other men in the house and there was this time the husband the wife brought another man in the home and when the husband came the wife told this man you don't need to go i need to do amenyaga to go mo ha na de komenya we goku so the husband came and slept and as he slept he started telling the wife and the wife insisted, do you know that? So a few months in your garden, I get a man, one, two, three, four, equally the man, I'm over me, the care. I can never walk and walk in your mouth. You see, 
believed they were two. He still believed they were four. He counted the four on the bed, forgot that he had stepped down. And it is that kind of a man that you still want to hold on as a husband and continue moving on. Because what is happening in our lives today, you just have to purpose to get to where you are going. Remove all the distractors on the way so that you get to where you are going. And especially you people who are in the diaspora. When you came here, you came on one purpose to make your life better. But now you are here and still leave you. And when you come, we always wait to see what you have come with. Okay. <laughs> and by the way, we get very happy. In the walk of the decade, we are very happy. And we feel very good. And we are very excited. We feel good at the decade we achieve. We are happy. And that is now the reason why we, we come accompanied with somebody like our brother Optimus Noachiuri. Because it is in this guy that you invest the little that you have. The people who can be trusted. He's one of our trusted companies. I used to be his um, brand ambassador before I became an MP. I was his brand ambassador. And uh, I told him, I told him before I become a brand ambassador, I want to research on your company and what you do. So I'm telling you people that you are the biggest target of our community. We are waiting for you to come. You have 10 more years to live here. When you come home, tunawangajia sana. Tuone. Kenya umekuja nacho. Tunakuangalia sande hii umekuja kandisa. Tuwana taweka jamu. Mawadio la etio adumakanta, makanta, uko kanta matano, uko tuweka testimony. And we feel very excited. So it is a time what you have, if what you have tried is not working, try something else. If that is not working, try something else. The unfortunate thing is um, women will keep trying other things. And I want to encourage you, encourage these big boys. Because these big boys, when it doesn't work, they get stuck. Then they are like, Tari watini ya mwaka wakawa kumbai kire te shukuru. I hear women have gone to college, have done nothing. Mambo wa isi kwa hivyo ya kia kato wa mwena waka hawa wano kuma. Tezo kia mwena di isi kuwa kia kia kia. Mimi kuja kutafta pesa. Wacha miambie pesa mahali hiko. But if we continue encouraging one another, giving one another hope, telling all of us that it is possible, investing in where we are able to invest, investing in that country, let them know you invest in their secret. But one day you can invest, you can buy land and start building and doing your own things such that when you come. Madame, <laughs> <laughs> and when you listen to their stories, you want to die. So if what you did now is not working, try something else until it works. Make sure that you deliver on what brought you here. There could be distractors. Even at home, we still could be a problem. We are depending on you so much. And you want to be everybody's darling. I am telling you, Mother when you who is supporting everybody. So support where you only can. Where you feel you are not stretching yourself. Where you feel you are doing it at your comfort. But don't try to impress anybody. Choose 
to praise your God and to move on with your life. No, I can't ever prove a point. What are the people you need to tell? Hey, mommy, why are you here? Those are the only people that should bother you. If your father is there, if your mother is there, those are the only people that are supposed to give you sleepless nights. And if your brother is threatening you, for one, your brother, na she ariyo na matire ho. At the movie you are today, you can't call us here. You can't call us here anymore. We are going to make sure you are okay. I know that you are the one who is here. You only need to do that. I will do it at my convenience. Not when you want, but when I want. When my husband feels it is the right time, we will come. But I owe you nothing. You owe your father, but he is now dead. So for your brothers, you will go when it is convenient. They need not to push you. Ni wewe kumbuki ni dawa na gini atoro na hatimu moto ujire teodo. No udseva tu tosho kato ilo kambi. Oh, no ali kura mraba na bishofu boke maani me. It is not about anyone. It is about the things that happen in our lives every day. Let you be a burden. Let the, your burden be your parents, your father. Ona tuma kuke ova burden. Eto na kema mimi daga. Iko tasi ya kiga hau usiro nage. Oke, iko taki tayari na kumi tawe ra. Hi, tangu wala kama ni majiro. Omo la omiri. Nadai kwa kuri ala duare. Kuna weta wao, weta wao du. Sitra dino. I na kwa hule. Mala dami ni yani yamu. Iri na zasa ana samson mwa kavu kumuhi bwa la mufen. Siga ite kwa wao, siga ite kwa wao. Iwe tara na kato watari. Pendo le haki. I know, I know what you people go through because even me, I started going through it. The people who believe once you are in parliament, you have everything. Somebody calls you and tells you, "The question is, can I now go for a million dollars?" Or I'm saying, "I but I can still have two million because when you are in government, you have that kind of money. So can we persist what is right? Follow our dreams. Go for what is us, and finally, we become what I was talking last night. We become the integrated. Because I was telling people in our old age, you are either integrated or you are lost. And the integrated ones are those I keep telling people, those who come to church and they give their testimonies and you want to identify with them. Atumi ya haki mo imagi na kani dhahari ya bere shushu mukuru na mwa kaiite na atumi dira na mwa ya shushu na atumi dira na na kamugazi ona na haki tatu waragi na na seventy five. Kau dah makan kau makan ni jenis baru washo. Tahu makan gratis wayirimu. Kau nak dekat nak boleh mungkin ni. Tahu yang gratis wayirimu. Kau moduri orang tahu senior ni. Nenek dah jenis. Kau yang tahu semanin nak kau lima kau jam kau lima enam. Muka kami rugi tak ada tu. Mungkin jauh siwa muka. Kau dah jenis wajar gigi. Kau mesti dia mesti salam. Hei anak aku. Kau 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 ini muka watel. Gedure la mwa ya ushio, na gima muda la faile de na wira giwaje sana mwanadam. Nime gikeni tena mwanadam yoyo, tuti atiga ni ira hau, tuto tora ni teka rugi do kara ihule mwenye gogoa, leare gogo kera, le mwenye meliwa moduri, le meliwa siana, aliato na waitora, na lejo kaka hara muda la faile kera jesu, jira hava, mwanadam yuko hemo. Nime gikeni tena muda ni geza doga mena gikudike kigea tumia, mada si ni onika na giro dika na chwa. Nemu nengi ukire nengi zato kama na tumia ya tuone maaji tete. Biko la tode kuo, mfati dira ali mwabasa, boka na SGR, usimu. Adwa wili, adwa wili mwaka uwa, na iso mweteo, tibweteo ni wekoa, uwekoa hao, imani hoa papa, sila wekoa uwa. Kuka ya na wila, nare mwana ni ya geto taibi ya dao mwako uwa siro, ni makea hile giriga nare mwede hile ya tumia, Lebih nak ke awak di mulu mukir lagi tu orang kokor ya terang terjauh dia nak ke ni atau ni ter oh giri gana nak di mukir nak ke pita nak mesti nak ke makir kokor ya London orang mah tu ter giri face ter ni kalau tu kalau itu kami ni kita mas nak awak kokor kokor yang naik kur nak kono kalau tu gerak dia kiri naik itu gerak siapa kau nama tu dia kok mana ni dia tu hati dia kokor hera kiri bagi kiri tu dia giri makan nama tan ah ni tu Jesus, <laughs> <laughs>
Mohanata Muranaka Hete Mui 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 Hete Tukiki <laughs> Men believe in the God of their mothers. And if you are bringing up a boy, please let him know you are God. Nataka muti. I remember the kitty gaiwani na. The girl who was your maker and has a kahora. We are not going to be able to say we are funny things. Ena o kore na guarena. But for women, we are not going to. Girl, you are saying you are not going to be able to be those women who are able to stand in church and give a testimony. And we are not going to be able 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 to but you see, it is still makes a statement, and it is telling people that you have persisted. So, in as much as we want to love God, the moment you have nothing to show. You can only show photos. Let these guys speak to us in two minutes and we'll be done. Thank you and God bless you. So I only come to conclude. Washiri, please, as these guys plan to invest, let them hear from you what you have in store. Well, let's appreciate our honor for Well, good evening. It's a good night, they say. Good night. Good evening, good night. Wow, good to see all of you. And uh, my name is George Washiri. I am extremely humbled that.